Sophia. Sophia. You know, I was so excited that you were finally coming home after so long. But after seeing what you've become, I kind of wish you hadn't bothered, to be honest. What do you mean, what I've become? This entitled, arrogant, self-absorbed prick. I don't care how much money you're making, Simon, what girls you're fucking or what Porsche you're driving. You never had any of those things and you were still my best friend. Sophia, you have no idea how hard I've worked to get where I am. So don't tell me I'm changing just because you're doing the same meaningless shit we did as teenagers. I'm not going to apologize for actually having done something with the last five years of my life. Okay. Well, I guess we both know what we really think of each other then. I'll see you in another five years, Simon. Sophia. I've missed you. Yeah, I missed you too. But that's not the point. I don't know what you want from me. I want my friend back. I don't know what this is. This is me. You might not like it, but it isn't much different from the boy you knew. That's exactly it. The boy I knew. He didn't care what other people thought. He'd cry watching Forrest Gump and sing Sinatra for me on my birthday. I still do those things. Really? Yeah. I don't believe you. Well, it's true. Let's hear it then. What? Sinatra. It's not your birthday. Yeah, you're right, but... You've missed the last five of them, so I think I mowed at least one song. You're making me do this now? Absolutely. I get no kick from champagne Mere alcohol, it doesn't thrill me at all so tell me why should it be true that I get a kick out of you? How was that? Good enough for you, your highness? Yeah, I guess so. I just about. <laughs> 